Welcome to Wandering World. This is another one of our adventures. Hope you like it. Yeah, this is a good idea to leave this short. It's just right. Yeah, good morning, good morning, good morning. Bye, I'm Buntag. Bye, I'm Buntag. Hmm. Where are you now, baby? We're at the Babcock State Park. Okay. Here at our little camping area. And then we're going to have a breakfast with matching humba and our rice because we still have it. And with our another table, our motif today, what color? Red. Red. The favorite color of Me. my dear baby Mai. Bye. And do this too. This what are you doing, baby? Huh? I'm roasting marshmallows. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll make mine golden brown. Okay. And here's our tent that we set up. And over there is another camper. Our bicycles are there. These other tent sites are really far away, which is good. This campsite was really, really big. As you can see, we're a long ways away from everybody else. We really enjoyed staying here. And there's our tent. It's a six-man tent. It's really big. It's comfortable for two people to stay in. And here is a picture of, I think, maybe me in the bed. And there's our uh, tent that covers a picnic table. And there's Sheila in slow motion running towards us. Oh, and there's me holding up this big old rock all by myself. And here is the waterfall at Babcock State Park. One of the reasons that we came there. And you can see that the woods there are really nice. We hiked up through there. There's me standing with my trucking pole. And here's some pictures of the walking trail. And there's the waterfall again. Really, really nice. They had an old uh, grain mill that was water driven that we had actually went there to see. It was the, it's the main attraction there. And I think here coming up, we're going to have some pictures of it. And here's a lake that was there at the Babcock State Park. They had a hiking trail all the way around this lake. Me and Sheila hiked around the whole thing. It only took us maybe 45 minutes to get all the way around. It was really nice and we enjoyed the little hike. And here it is, the old water-driven grain mill that's still in operation today. What a beautiful sight this is here. I was going to fry my dome, drone, but they only allow you to fly it during a certain part of the day. And that time had expired, so we just enjoyed the water and walking around the area. So if you get a chance, make your way on down to West Virginia. It's uh, South West Virginia, probably um, an hour's drive from Clarksburg, if you're familiar with that area. 
the campground where we were at was one of the nicest ones I think that we have been to so far. And as you can see here, I'm enjoying a marshmallow that I had just roasted over our campfire. We didn't know it, but we were glad to find out when we got there that you can buy firewood right there from the uh, little store that's just a, a short walk away.